Hi and thanks for joining me today for my weighing update. If you're new to my channel, my name is Joanne and I'm calorie counting using the app NutriCheck. And um, <clears throat> yeah, so this week, as you know if you've been watching me, I had an easier day set last Saturday and I've been on 1,330 throughout the week. Um, I did have a couple of days where I saved some calories because um, I had gone over again on the Saturday. So to try and protect my weight loss, I saved some of the calories hoping that I could limit some of the damage. Um, and I thought and hoped, expected that I would get a weight loss by doing this. So did I get that? I will tell you in a minute. So this week, um, I've had a really lovely week, I had some lovely food, um, yeah, so everything's been fine. So apart from, obviously, uh, again, if you've been following my journey, you'll see that I have had a few ladies' problems and um, excessive bleeding this week. So I felt quite bloated on some of the days. Um, so obviously I've been carrying some fluid um, and looking at my ring at the moment now it's very tight on me so I'm obviously I am carrying fluid so with that to think about as well um, I didn't know what I would expect this week obviously I've been um, following my calories and everything's been fine um, it's just that I've had this um, health issue. So anyway, I got on the scales this morning and really hoping that I would see a result this week. And I stood on the scales and I gained two pounds. Two whole pounds I gained. So... You can imagine how I'm feeling right now. Um, very, very disappointed, gutted. Um, I don't know what else to say. I just, I don't know. It's, it's not fair. It's truly not fair. Um, I just don't know. And then I read um, something earlier. Somebody had said. Um, they came in with a pound weight loss this morning and they were so pleased they'd had um, two heavy nights drinking watching a football and they'd had a Chinese takeaway and a meal out and they came in and lost a pound. Now I've done what I've done this week that you've all seen and I've gained two pounds. How can that be fair? I, it, it just, I don't know. I'm just, I am lost for words. And to be honest, I really felt like throwing it all in and think, you know, what the hell, just just forget it. There's no point um, because I've been struggling and struggling and I don't know. Um, I simply go round and round in circles. I've upped my calories. I've dropped my calories. Um, I just don't, I don't know what the answer is anymore. And like we've got our holiday now in a couple of weeks and when I told you about my holiday I really hoped that I would have lost at least half a stone for that. Well obviously that isn't going to happen unless a miracle happens over the next two weigh-ins. If I weigh in for the next two weeks because I am at that stage now where I'm kind of thinking what's the point? Well I know what the point is because obviously you know the weight that I've lost with Slimming World previously before I started calorie counting it's all going to go back on um, because I am that type of person that just has to to look at a bar of chocolate or I don't know a bag of chips or whatever and I gain I literally that is how I am so if I do stop doing this following a calorie control diet I'm going to be back up to where I was and I certainly don't want that again. So then I thought maybe I'll give YouTube a knock on the head for a while and see how it goes 
just doing it myself because obviously I'm coming on here telling you most weeks I've either maintained, now I've gained. Um, so lots of um, emotions running through at the moment. But um, I don't know really what to say for this week as to my calories. I was originally going to do, not have an easier day today, and then have 1,400 you know, every day instead of having an easier day today and then reducing them for the rest of the days. So that was my plan. Um, up to now, I've been on plan today. I haven't gone over my calories. But I'm at that stage of this time where I'm thinking, let's just have a blowout. Let's just have a bit of what I fancy and start back tomorrow. Which then will end up being that I will be over the 1400 calories. So it's just such a vicious circle. And then I get people telling me, well, you're not eating enough through the week. You know, you need to give your body, give it some more food and then go back on to the calorie counting. So you're shocking your body. I really don't know what to do. So if any of you got any answers for me, you know, I any comments, then I'm going to read every single one and take it all in. Because I'm having um, a meal for my tea that is all within my calories. Um, I've got a cake to share with my husband, and that will be worked into my calories. But there is some chocolate in the house, which if you look tonight at my shopping haul you'll see and I'm kind of thinking well I'm going to have some of that tonight um, and just enjoy it but do I go on the 1400 calories tomorrow and thereafter or do I go on back to 1330 or do I go even lower than that that is my question I I just, I'm hoping for some answers to help me out a little bit because it's getting very frustrating. So, anyway, I'm going to stop rambling on now. And um, as I say, anyone that can help, comment, I'd really appreciate the feedback. Um, so, I have two more weigh-ins before my holiday. I mean, any so-called normal person could possibly lose half a stone in two weeks but as we know that's not quite how my body works but I mean I'm sure if if things were working as they should be I should be able to lose like three or four pounds but things aren't working as they should be so I just need somebody to reassure me and tell me what to do from now on so I'm going to go and um, hopefully you'll join me later to see what I've eaten today. Um, probably ending over calories, I would imagine. But yeah, anyway, if you're here just for my weigh-in, thanks for joining me and I'll see you again next week, hopefully. Um, and yeah, so thanks again. Bye. <laughs>